What's up? So, I'm not going to sugarcoat anything. Those are probably the worst picks I've ever made. I remember I did picks for TNA or Impact Hard to Kill. And my picks were so bad, I didn't even do a reaction video to it. I just straight up ignored it. But I just got a text from Jay Brown. Uh, I think he was afraid I was going to do the exact same thing since out of the four matches, I only got one right. Uh, he thought I was going to skip that. I wasn't. But I guess he showed mercy and I guess he felt bad about putting me on blast on his podcast. He sent me an audio of a rap review. He said, I'm not going to freestyle it, but I'm going uh, to say something on the audio. And I'm like, I'll take it. So I guess we got to do that. And, um, but before we go to the computer and listen to this, let's join the fray. See if this bad boy's about. Man, I can't believe how bad do those picks, bro. All right, let's see. Be kind of fast. The Women's Royal Rumble is where we start. When Naomi coming back, that brought joy to my heart. But Jordan Grace didn't see that coming. But her and Ivy Neal looked like they were starting some impressive commentators of the WWE, but ate a KOD from the EST. Damage control looked to be on the tear, but the Kabuki Warriors got eliminated out of nowhere. You call Piper Naya? Tightened up, Cole, but she came out next. I guess he had the crystal ball, but her and Piper down like a kaiju seed. But who suffered as a result? Chelsea Green! If our truth is a treasure, let's keep him around. Five seconds later, the howl was done to the ground. Nia Jax looking like a tornado in the ring. Roxanne Perez was impressive as she does her thing. Finally, Jade is here. She's arrived at last and eliminated Naya. Now that's badass. Liv Morgan is back and all is right with the world. Eliminated Zoe Starks. That's my girl. Something that I never knew that I wanted. EST versus Jade Cargill. Triple H, get on it. Bailey is your 2024 winner tonight. Now, I haven't said this too much. Jimmy was right. Roman enters the match and then he gets jumped to 25% chance to win the final sunk. But he held his own. Don't count the Tribal Chief out because he's still on a different level even in this bout. Blunt force trauma, but still no three count. And then the style slash, still no three count. Three RKO's and to no surprise the buzz line snatching the match before our eyes. That's why Solo's ass went through a wall. Styles nearly came away with the win after he stacked them all. At the end of the match, the spirit is the very end. But to Roman's credit, he deserved that win. Still Universal Champion for how long? I hate to say this, Jimmy, but you got that wrong. KO versus Paul for the US belt. The announcer's kissing Logan's ass. They really need help. Buckshot, Larry, followed by a splash. KO kicked out, but Logan's still talking trash. He keeps attacking KO's hand. Then he hits him with a KO and he kicked out before three again. Brass Nuts handed by off the theory. It backfired. Well, I guess not. Jackie Q was weary. Kale lost his mind. But was he wrong? Oh, by the way, Jimmy, he also got that wrong. The Uso twins from number one and number two finally got them in the match. Now, this is new. El Hilo back in the E. How? The first to be eliminated? Grace and Waller. Get the camera away from Karen Cross's crotch. What the hell was that? Cameraman for the Does group get into a scuffle with the pride when the AOP and the Street Profits arrive? Mm -hmm. Cody coming out, and he's trying to repeat. Eliminating Austin Theory? For me, that was a treat. Gunther coming out, chopping everybody in sight. Then eliminates Kofi? Now, that ain't right. Braun tosses Omos, Dom tosses Braun, McAfee in the rumble, but not very long. In case you didn't hear me, I'll say it again. Our truth is a treasure. Please protect him. Sami Zayn is back. Goes after Drew in the ring, but Drew eliminates him. Is Karma now the thing? Then it comes down to Punk and Rose. Quick to say it, Jimmy. Well, it's definitely not the one you chose. The road to WrestleMania started tonight. So Cody Rose to WrestleMania it just sounds right. Cody wins the rumble, but will he finish the story or will the tribal chief continue his reign of glory? WrestleMania at the link, and I'll be there. My seats won't be the best, but I won't even care because it's going down to Philly and it's going to be live. Now, this ain't wrestling related, but I knew he was going to throw the Eagles stuff in there. Alrighty. So, 
I guess that was it in a nutshell. So yeah, I got one right, three wrong. I was one for four. So uh, he pretty much laid it all out there. And uh, that's where we're going to end it. And no, I am not discussing any Vince McMahon business. I, I'm, I'm not getting into that. Uh, we're not getting into that at the Wrestling Fray. Um, no, we're, we're, we don't do that type of news. Anyway, thanks for joining the fray. Y'all have a good night. The Mickey Mouse.